Let's go. Welcome back to a brand new video. We're jumping into State of Decay 2. I've been wanting to play this on the channel for quite a while. I've played a few times in the last couple weeks with our good friend Otto, and I'm kind of getting used to it. We know a little bit about it, not very much about it. We got to play it a little bit just to kind of understand the basic mechanics of the game. Let's get into an actual playthrough here. We're going to do at least a few videos for this one. This is a lot of fun. I really enjoy this game. I'm kind of crazy into the zombie games lately, obviously, with Seven Days to Die and a lot of other games like that that we really enjoy lately. So let's jump into this one. A lot of fun. State of Decay 2. We're going to go campaign. We're going to go new community, and we're going to go ahead and skip the tutorial. This gives you a nice little function because you can choose which city you go to, and then we can choose our little first trio for our community. I Now, I don't know a lot about the town, so I don't know which one is the best one to go for here. So we're just going to do it by looks. Uh, that one's a little too shiny. That one's a little too beat down. That one's a little random. Let's go with, I kind of like that one, but I also kind of like that one. Let, let's go with... We're going to go with Providence Ridge. I think I've checked this one out before. This one looks a lot of fun. I think it's got a lot of verticality to it. Let's check this out. Let's go ahead and do... We're just going to do basic difficulty because I don't know a lot about the game just yet. So we're just going to go standard difficulty. If we get through a playthrough, maybe we'll go back and do a harder difficulty later on. But for right now, I think standard makes sense. Let's get into it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. I really do appreciate it. If you guys want to see more of State of Decay 2, please let me know in the comments down below. And we will definitely continue with this playthrough a little bit longer. That's kind of how we determine how long these playthroughs go. So let's go ahead and do this. So we can apparently kind of randomly cycle through and see if we get lucky with it. Now, I don't really know which skills or stats are best, but we're gonna click it a few times and see if we get lucky. There's only so many of the different faces that you can get, but there's so many different traits and different skills that can randomize too. It's really cool. Uh, we got Krista. She's worked at an office. Played Tetherball, smooth talker. She's pretty good with fighting. Let's keep her, I like her. She looks awesome. This one has great wits. She was a CEO. I'm already out. Let's get rid of her. Attended trade school. Nothing wrong with that. That's awesome. Stamp collector. I don't know if that's going to help me, but he's got that craftsmanship skill. Let's keep him. Now, we're going to need a... I need someone that can shoot on this last one, so let's get ourselves someone that can shoot. If you can't shoot, I, I can't help you. Let's go. Shakespearean actor. I don't think that's going to get it done. Fire marshal. I like that. Attended trade school. Prefers the sidelines. Utilities. That is really cool, but that's not going to help us. Traits, ran a medical office, skater, food hoarder. Oh, oh, this lady has medicine. There's more traits than what we've seen. Dang. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, Krista. You're going to have to go away because this one's kind of awesome. Ran medical off office. We're going to need that. Her medicine is a little bit higher, so we're going to stick with her. I'm sorry, lady. I really want to keep you on the team, but we're going to go on. Trust fund kid. Nope, we're out. Picnicker, high lung capacity. Okay. Congrats, you have, you have good lungs. Video game streamer. Those guys are the worst. We don't want that. Let's go ahead and skip that. Bronto gas attendant. Nothing wrong with that. Homebody, Bronto gas attendant. We're getting a lot of gas attendants. Let's do this until we get someone that can shoot. Knife thrower. That's kind of cool. And that's that same lady in terms of the face. Now we need a shooter. I need someone that can shoot. Oh, she's really good at fighting. They keep teasing me with this. Oh, my God. I'm going to sit here and click this forever. Oh. We got an upgrade. Nurse, she's a little bit better at medicine. Dang, I'm sorry. Now you're gone. See you later, hipper. <laughs> All right. This is kind of how it's going to keep going. We're going to keep seeing different ones here. We're just going to click this until I see one that says shooting. I need someone that can help me shoot. I, I don't know if that's really an important thing or not, but I just feel like it is, right? Wow, it is fully random. There's no way to control. Oh, there we go. Some of them can shoot. Backwoods upbringing, wandering guitarist. I don't know if she looks trustworthy, though. All right, we're going one more. Let's go. Shooting, 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 shooting. Boom, there we go. Neighborhood watch, decent shot. Got decent wits and nice shooting stat. There we go. That is going to be our community. So we have Ratched, Erica, Vaughn, Luke, Luke, Supamoncon. I'm so sorry I can't pronounce that. And then we got Dave, a.k.a. David Cochran. Let's go start community. Are you sure this is what you want? I am not sure, but we're going to roll with it. Let's go ahead and check this out. So, State of Decay 2, I've played State of Decay 1 quite a bit back on the Xbox. I played this a little bit on the Xbox on Game Pass when it came out, and it's been sitting in our Steam library forever, so it's time to finally jump into it. I did see that a couple of the big YouTubers played it recently, too, so that kind of made me want to jump into it even more. I think it was, uh, was it Games for Kicks or Game Edge? One of those guys that played it. We were checking it out. It definitely looked really cool. There is the crew. There is a little bit of soft storyline in this, from what I can tell. I have a better idea. We could settle down here instead of moving on. I like that idea. Let's do it. I admit, it looks better than the last couple of towns we came through. It does. Are we good? Now that you mention that, we're going to let them go through the audio here. 
Now, if you play the tutorial, you get a whole tutorial to begin with, and then a very specific crew when you get started, and I think you actually get a couple cool perks out of that, like a weapon or two that are worth it. Maybe with some room to expand. That's it, man. We just got to find a base. Let's do it. All right, let's check this place out. So we are... Ooh, Camp Winchester. Nice. Looks like we're going up the hill. So yes, I have been in this area before. This is a cool map to get started on. Now these... Uh, it does say it's rideable. Can we drive? All right. <laughs> she climbed over. Okay. Oh, we got no gas. Okay, that's why that's sitting there. That makes a lot of sense. That's probably what you would come in on with the tutorial if that was the case. This is a nice little town. I think to begin with, there's not going to be a lot of zombies, right? Like It's going to be a minute before they kind of jump in on us. Let's go take over our first place. Not a bad first little spot to go. Up on the top right, it's always going to give us our little kind of to-do task that we'll be doing. Let's go over here. The place. Oh, do my thing. there's someone in there. Oh, we got to clear it out. Okay, I wasn't ready for that. All right, take it out. Boom. You go finish that guy off. Oh, good job, lady. Yeah, let's, let's definitely claim it. How do we claim it? Go over here. No? Here. There we go. Claim home site. All right. Requires three. Requires just one. So three out of one. Total slots eight. Infirmary, parking, and fire watch tower. Let's do it. Yes, we want to take over. All right. Here we go with the first base place. Now, this has just a lot of different pre-built bases that you can take over as you play this. It's really cool. We got two parking spots with this one. So if we get the car up here, it does repair as it sits in there from what I remember. Or at least it did with the old game. All right, got a little bit of influence, and now our two friends are going to stay inside of here. All right, optional, use the survey point. Let's do that first. We'll go ahead and go up here, and then we'll talk about the different menus for the characters. I really like the way this game works out. It's kind of a zombie community colony survival. I don't know what you want to call it, but it's definitely a very cool game. Got a, a huge open world. Not really like building, although you do kind of build within the base. I wish there was a little bit more of that. And State of Decay 3 is right around the corner, which is why we really want to jump into this. Anything to search up here, or is it just... Yep, site secure. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and look around. Anything over here? There you go. Sealed storage lockers. I'm making some good progress over here. A couple garages. About damn time. Oh, okay. Ratchet has recovered from fatigue. Good job. Tartan Mart. We got Winchester Urgent Care. Anything else over here? House with a nice view. Empty carport. Fading billboard. Waffle Depot, Providence Tax Prep, Garden Supply, Spoil Station, must be the gas station, some red warehouses, Winchester Fruit Stand, Ruined Car Lot, very cool, Army and Navy Outfitters, that sounds like it'd be a good spot to go to, Campsite, North East Camp Restroom, North East Campsite, Ranger Station, Ranger Station, and Ranger Tool Shed. All right, what are we missing? We missed one. Where is it? Oh, man, I got a, I got an achievement out of that. I don't know if you guys hear that beep or not. Yeah. And last Somewhere one, trashed self-storage. Very cool. All right, we need to scavenge the nearby site for rucksack materials. Is that already marked? It looks like it is right there. How do we mark it? Can we mark it? We can go to the map. Hit M for the map. It's going to bring up all the cool things over here. This little red area is basically a place that's... This whole area is kind of like a, a advanced infection called the play cart. Like, that's where all the bad, bad zombies are. We're not going to go there yet. Let's go ahead and click on that so we can make a waypoint. All right, let's go check it out. So now the inventory stuff for this is really cool. I do like the way the inventory works on this one. We need some guns so we can really defend this place. And this is going to be a lot of fun. I'm really excited about playing this one. Let's go ahead and head down. All right. So now the way this works, you can go through and you can actually switch your characters. You've got your supply over here in the middle. Open supply locker. So we can actually throw stuff from our inventory up to here. Over here is a place that we can build something here in a little bit once we get some supplies. Over here is our actual storage. We can come over here and drop off bags when we get bags. Another open spot to build in. And then this is a radio. I don't really know what that's used for just yet. What's that say? Base management. 
Oh, there's the base management screen. This is how we do the building. So you can click on these different slots to build stuff. Looks like we already have an infirmary. Awesome. So far, minimal risk. We got three people. We can view community details. Three population. Three out of three available, available labor. One available bed provided by Firewatch Tower. And used by plus three population. Very cool. All right. Looks like there's... It's still got a... It says there's one more thing going on. I'm not sure what that is. All right. Well, let's just go do this first mission. Now, we got to keep an eye on the bottom left. You can see the blue and the red bar down there. One is your stamina. One is your health. So we'll keep an eye on those guys. And then we can go out here. We can kind of run around. If we do the shift button, we do a little bit of running. If we hit the C button, we do a little bit of dodge. And control is your sneak button. Kind of standard stuff. The inventory, I believe, is the I button. Goes into your inventory. Looks like we have a rusty screwdriver and a pipe. The screwdriver is for our close combat melee. Very cool. Let's go get it. Got to be very careful out here. I'm not trying to get into a bunch of trouble. Let's see if we can sneak behind this. The little up-close stealth kills are pretty sweet. Right, we're going to sneak up behind you. All right. Sneak right behind this guy. Get E to do a little bit of stealth action. Boom. Some brutal kills. I love the way the kills go on this one. All right, we're not actually going into there. Let's just keep going. I thought we'd be searching that place. That truck got jacked up. Now, later on, there's things like wandering hordes, and then there's a, events where they actually come and attack your base. Very cool stuff. That looks like a crazy one. What is that? That dude had some crazy eyes. Hold on. Let's get behind him. He might just be a normal guy, but he looked crazy with those glowing eyes. Maybe he's like a feral. I don't exactly know how those guys work in this game. Let's sneak behind this guy and... Knife to the head. Well, not a knife. A screwdriver. Same thing. All right. Now, the left click does your attacks, and that pulls out your heavy weapon. If you have a, a gun or a weapon, if you hold right click, it does your aiming. But since we don't have one right now, we can't do anything with it. All right. On the bottom there, you also have a couple things over where it says the Q button down at the bottom. We can cycle through with the middle mouse button, and then we hit, I guess, Q to go ahead and use either one of those. All right, this looks like our first search spot. Let's do it. The air tastes like blood. There's got to be a plague heart around. Probably lots of plague zombs, too. Okay, we're going to go in here. If you go to the map, sometimes you'll see special zombies, too. If there's any special ones near you, you'll usually be able to see those. I see a guy out there. We're going to ignore him for now. I think we're just going into this place, right? Can I go in there or is there a side door? All right. I think it's F for the light. No here now, but there will be. All right, so this place is quiet. Can I close the door, please? Close the door. All right, let's get to searching. You can quick search, but we just want to kind of search a little bit slow through here. It should light up. There it is. And you just hold E to search. If you want to go fast, you hold the, the left shift button. But it has a chance to make a bunch of noise. So you got to be careful. Uh, quality materials. Rush, nice. But I'm done now. Okay. Cool shit. Oh, we got some gas. Nice. Give us some gas for the car. If we get a little bit of gas, we'll go down and get that car that's down there. I guess it's kind of useful. There we go. It's kind of useful. Yeah, it's gas, dude. Finish searching this. Looks like it can be claimed as an outpost. Now you only get so many outposts. We don't want to use it until it's time. All right. Search that guy. And over on the top left, you can see site may contain and how many containers you searched. Shit, nada. Nothing. That's how you claim the outpost. We're not going to do that because that does take influence. Since we're over here, should we do the house? I think so. I say we do it. Let's do it. This one has six things to search. Oh, yeah, dang. Locked. Yep. Be quieter. That's not great. Let's go over here. Wait for them to come to us. That was a little more noise than I want to make. All right. Let's do it. Come on. Finish it. Finish it. 
All right, is that the only one that hurt us? All right, let's go search it. Now, when you go... Oh, yep, that was loud. Oh, we got lots of friends. Okay. Let's see if we can stealth these guys. All right, come on. Gotta stay frosty. Plague zombies all over the place. There you go. Super stealth. There you go. Get it. Maybe this guy. There's that one. One more. Come on. Some nice little stealth kills. Oh, that ups our wits. Nice. I didn't even see which character we brought out. All right. Let's search this stuff. We're probably going to end up with more stuff than we can carry, but we'll carry as much as we can. Must be somebody outside the fence. I hear one more. All right. We got a bag of snacks. Nice. All right. I don't know where the zombie is. Maybe it's inside? loud okay search this guy looks like the outside ones don't even count as part of the search items does it some screws we need those to build stuff at the base okay let's close the door all right nope stop <laughs> don't open it again all right got this And just keeping out for everything. We got three more areas to search. A little bit of food. All right, looks pretty quiet in here. A couple more areas to search. We got a little bit of inventory left. Let's quick get through this kind of quick. I might fast search a little bit. We've got jug of ethanol, frayed sheet of notebook paper, and a puffy vest. Oh, cool. Puffy vest, black and gold. Select a survivor on the community screen and press C to view your closet. Okay, we'll do that when we go back. All right, let's search a little fast. Just tap the shift button a couple times. Right. I think it said toothpaste. One more room. Looks like I can rest for a second right, at least. Site secure. There we go. All right, I think we're good. We'll get this and then we'll head back to the base. We got more ethanol. Okay. And then if we wanted to, we could try to claim this place. But like I said, we... Oh, it says that we missed something. What did we miss? Okay, looking here. Here we go. Oh, an ammo box. I'm glad we came back. Guess that's it for this place. Uh, and we are full. So we got pipe bomb. Let's see, tube of fireworks, placeable decoy. Let's drop that. Hold on, R. Definitely take the rounds. Luxury item treat. Okay, I guess I can't take that last piece. Okay, let's go. Give you a little careful sprinting all the time just because it takes a bunch of your energy. And then you're going to have to have your guys rest more often, but we're kind of in a hurry. Looks like the zombies are really starting to kind of plus up out here. But I'm going to go see if we can put gas in the car now. I don't actually know how to fuel cars up, but we'll try it real quick. Everything okay? And we'll take that car up to the base and let it sit there and get repaired if it's got any brakes to it. Yeah, we need a gun. We really, really need a gun. Now, there are, since we have like a specific addition, I know there's like things that we can call in. We can do... Ultimate Edition Vehicle Delivery and some Supply Drops, but we'll leave that alone for right now. There we go. Everything you do does level something up, too. There's our cardio leveling up. All right, we're going to get the car first. Shut that light off. Nighttime is pretty long in this one and very dangerous as well. But it's a lot of fun. Once we start getting into some cars and doing some stuff, this game gets a lot of fun. Oh, there's a special zombie over there. It looks like a Screamer or Screecher or something like that. Gonna run down and get this car. Right, is it this one? Or is it the next one? Does look like you. There's a lot of zombies out there. 
I'm not exactly sure how like the level up system works on this, but I know they as you're doing things, you just randomly get levels up to certain things. All right, how do we do this? Ride. Does the gas automatically fill up? Nope. How do I fill it up? Refuel. There we go. Okay, anybody coming to me? Boom. All right, that got us a little bit. There you go. We already have a ride. Let's go. Oh, good driving. We're very, very good at driving. There you go. Okay. Go park it up here. All right. When vehicle is parked at your base, approach the rear of the vehicle and press E to transfer items. Okay. Looks like there is... How do we do this? Okay, we'll come back for it. I'm not exactly sure how to do that yet. All right, so the stuff on our bag we put here. It's time to get building. And then we'll go grab the rest of the stuff. Infirmary would be a good place to start. That deposited those materials. Nice. Grab case of disinfectant. Go like that. All right. Yeah, here's Deposit three shit. meds. Nice. All right, one more. And last thing we got is juice concentrate nice get a little bit of food very cool all right sweet all right so who am I, who exactly am i playing with we are let's see if i go like this and we click on our player we are currently playing as luke Suppa mong kong i'm definitely jacking that up attended trade school and was a stamp collector really high wits really high craftsmanship very cool on the left side, it shows you their health, their stamina, and their morale. Looks like his morale is straight-faced. <laughs> okay. All right. We need to upgrade your base by building the new facility. So I think we go press B to go to build. And we can do either of these. Covered space. Outdoor space. I think we can do it here. And we want to do a workshop. I'm glad we've already got a start on building this place up into something real. There we real. go. And a workshop gets built up over here. And then the workshop, we can make a bunch of stuff inside of here. All right, it's gonna take a minute before I think it's ready. If you're up for playing good neighbor, we'd be grateful. Looks like we got some neighbors to go talk to. I'm coming to you. All right. Glad folks like you are still out there. Now, if we go over here, I think this is how we switch, right? View beds? No. Yep. Let someone take over. All right. So you can see. Oh, what is this? Okay. What was that? Not really sure what was going on there. That was weird. Okay, view bed. Manage mods. Oh, I don't have any mods. That's cool. Install, manage, or uninstall mods at this facility. Oh, mods for the thing. I was thinking like mo game mods. All right, action. I don't know what this is, but let's go ahead and switch from Luke to Dave. All right, how do we do this? Take control. Boom. All right. We'll let him do his thing. We're rolling with Dave now. All right, let's check out Dave, because I don't remember what he was. Dave is... Where does it stay? His stuff here. He is standing citizen, neighborhood watch, and decent shot, which does affect skills. Okay. I thought there was a way to look at like what they were before all this. I guess it just says... Uh, I don't really remember. I guess it's just that right there, the traits. Okay. All right, talk to Carrie. Good ones. Oh, this one. Oh, you're not. Oh, Carrie is out there. Okay. Assess survivor inventory. Endless follower. Switch to this character. Take it okay. easy. All right. We're taking this guy out. He's got a really cool little pipe bat thing. And now we're going to go talk to Carrie. Could have swore I heard a zombie or something. All right, that's pretty far away. Let's go get to it, though. We could have taken a car. Do we, do we want to take the car? There's not a lot of fuel, but I think we get fuel pretty quickly. And just for the interest of time, I think we'll drive it a little bit. All right, let's go. It is a little beat up. There you go. Let's get going. All oh, these things are fun to drive. All right, let's go take a quick trip. And I think they all a automatically aggro when we drive a vehicle, which is the danger of the vehicle, too. 
Oh, yeah, they're definitely getting mad. All right, we are going right here. Okay, are they coming? Oh, they are. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Holy crap. Are they going to keep coming? Should I hide in the in the grass? Oh, this is bad. Okay. We can probably take them, but it really drains your stamina to be doing that. Okay, can we creep around him? Let's go see if we can mark him real quick. All right. Take that. Okay, he's the only one that was over here, so we're going to go in now. Let's go talk to these new friends. I think they're inside here. All right, let's do it. What's up, peeps? All right, who are we talking to here? We got... Oh, there we go. We got three of them in here. So we're talking to... Kate or Carrie. Carrie. Hello. All right. One of our supply plague samples has run low. If you can find more, we have fuel to trade. I think we can handle that. The safest way to collect samples is by killing plague zombies. Okay. The best place to find them is in the territory around a plague hub. Gotcha. So I need to kill. Your whole environment. That's pretty nice. He's still talking. Or you can just destroy the plague heart itself to get a bunch of samples. I don't think we're quite ready for the plague heart. Make sure you gear up for this one. Be okay. ready to fight. I think we can talk Helping to one of these guys to buy stuff. Yeah, go trade with run. Enclave. Oh, they got a shotgun. I wish. Let's hope this pays off. We could use what do I need for it? Here. Will you give it to me? Oh, we have cash. Okay, I have 415. They have 381. So if I take that... Alright, that took a bunch of my money. They don't have rounds for it, though. So I have a gun. No rounds. Alright. Metal bat. 30. Okay. Bandages take that nope painkiller painkiller energy drink firecracker okay cool well we got a, a new shotgun weapon we just don't have rounds for it yet it looks cool though all right obtain plague samples looks like we got some stuff in the base place that we'll go look at all right we missed that one a bunch of times Feel free to drop some plague samples for us. No? Okay. Like, I don't really know which ones we have to take out. Let's just keep going. Let's see if I can sneak him here. This is a big dude. Please don't get mad. Oh, brutal takedown. Nice. Nothing. Oh, it's definitely sending us up there. Oh, workshop is completed. Nice. Okay, looks like we're having to go up here. I think that's where the plague heart is. That kind of worries me. If I take out the nearest plague heart, this should clear up. All right, let's go. I don't think we're ready to take on the plague heart. I mean, we could try it. Oh, it's further up. Keep going. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Let's hit him. Let's do it. Let's have a little fun with the car. All right, that gave us a little bit. Almost down. Got that one. Okay, finish him. All right, we got plague sample times one. Is that it? Oh, the zombies are thick over there. We got one sample out of that. Dang. Okay. I'm going to park this right here. We are definitely in the thick of it up here. Let's do this. Okay. I think we're going in. I think this place is going to get nasty. Do I have any better... Yeah, see, we don't even have... I don't have rounds. Let's go put that in there. Plague sample in there. Okay. 
Should we call for help? Daybreak, multiplayer, supply drops. No. I was hoping we could call our friends up here. I guess we're good. Let's go. It was a bad idea. I'm here for a job. Time to do it. Locked up. Yep. Yep, I know it's going to bring people. Let's go. Oh, God, there's a couple of them. There we go. Finish that one. Oh, good job. Good job, dude. You've wrecked some absolute face there. There is the play card. All right. Last time I did this, this got nasty. We did this with a friend, though. I'm a little afraid. Ready? Okay, ready? Let's go. There's gotta be a better way to kill this thing. Yep, I think we got friends coming. Let's go. Yep, there it is. I told you. There's one. Ready? Since we're here, we're gonna take this guy, these guys out. Let's get this plague sample. That actually gives us two of two. Alright, I'm gonna try to take out the plague sample. Or the plague heart of me. Oh, God. Okay, is that it? Okay, ready? There's gotta be a better way to kill this thing. Yep, watch out. Alright, ready? Here comes the business. How bad is it? Just one? No, we got a couple. Ready? Alright, take him out. Take him out. Okay, are they both dead? Okay, we've got more of them coming. We might have to take off. Oh, we got hit. No! No! Oh, we were trying to not get infected this time. It didn't work. My bad. Alright, we are definitely infected now, so let's just go ahead and do it. I was really trying not to get infected this time. That is my fault. Okay, let's go. There's gotta be a better way to kill this thing. Can I not kill it without a gun? Maybe I can't kill it without a gun. There it goes. There it goes. I can't keep okay, going. that hurt. Oh god. Yep. Go, 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 buddy, go. Come on, you got this. There you go, 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 go. Yep. We'll come back. Sorry, buddy. Get him off. Get him off. There you go. Okay, can you guys drop? Why are they not dropping? There they go. All right. Okay, that didn't go quite like I had hoped. All right, let's turn around. We're going to go back and talk to our new friends. Oh, solid driving. Good job. All right. Let's go take these samples to them. We'll at least make friends. All right. Hey, guys. Uh, it, it didn't go well, but we got your stuff. Okay, no. We don't want to claim post. I just want to talk to Carrie. Here you go. There's your plague samples. samples. I can make something that'll cure blood plague if one of us gets infected. Very cool. We're happy All right. to share the recipe if you need it. So, enlist follower. Later. Does it take just the one? Like, I want all of them. I need some help. You want to come with? Okay, Carrie is now following. I'm right behind you. Later. Okay, we'll just leave it there then. All right. Guess what? Something's come up. As long as even one of those damn play cards is left, I won't sleep well at night. Okay. So it's probably going to want us to take out the play card. That's going to have to wait for next episode. I got to figure out how to cure our guy now. Oh, my bad. All right, let's go back to base. I'm going to end it there. It's nighttime. Perfect timing. See you guys in the next episode. Stay in the cave part two.
Let me know what you guys think. See if you want to see more of this or if you want me to move on to another survival game. See if there's something else we can get into. Oh, that guy was like all up on our business. All right. We're going to park right here. We're going to call it a day. We're a little infected. It's a little rough. Everything's fine. <laughs> see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much. I'll try to figure out how to get healed up because this is kind of rough. Okay. Look, we do want to try to do this. Treat plague and infection. Let's do that. And Dave. Boom. All right, so I think he's checked into the infirmary now, right? Does he actually sit down inside of there? How does that work? Oh, that's cool. Game's pretty cool, man. See you guys in the next one.